Hey guys, welcome to Draco Soul Cards YouTube page, which I am going to be changing to Draco's Minions. It's a new name I've been using um, on my Etsy store and stuff. I just want to give you an update about what I've been doing, where I've been. I haven't been on the YouTube scene in a long time, and it's mainly because I've been suffering from depression. I've been trying to find something that can draw my interest back to designing well, not my interest, but my my passion's there. It's just when I sit down to draw something like this and behind me, I just lose. I just don't want to do nothing. And it's depression. Um, it's been about a year and a half. It's been going pretty, pretty bad. So about around March, I uh, picked up a new hobby, and it goes with the passion for 3D designing. Is I'm doing 3D printing. So, basically, to catch you up, I have three Ender 3 Pros, one bamboo lab printer, and over here in this tent, because it stinks, is a resin printer. There, if you have no space for any kind of stink or any way to manage it, don't get a resin printer. Um, it's really bad. Uh, Especially in living space. If there's a garage or something, you'd probably be okay. I'm getting a lot of light glare. Anyways, um, it's not my forehead. Anyways, so I got all this material from 3D printing. There's my normal setup over there. If we go over here, it's my work desk. It's a mess. It's also my crafting area. Um, I've been doing 3D printing for work. It's not normal. I normally just design car parts, but they've had tools that needed pieces, and it's cheaper for me to 3D print them for them than it is to have somebody make them out of aluminum. So I've been doing that. So I'm going to bring you guys into this world with me. I'm going to try to get back into the YouTube stuff. Um, so I'm going to break my channel down into three a couple areas. I don't want separate channels. I want a one-stop shop. So... I'm going to try to get back into Blender tutorials or just you guys seeing how I do things. 3D printing those things. Casting those... I'm not going to hold up my middle finger. Casting those things into uh, silicone, which is something I'm working on now. And then casting... I guess we molding them in silicone. Casting acrylic into that. Um, for an example of that... Just offhand, I've been working on some D&D dice. And then these things go up for sale on my Etsy page. So, so I've got my own design of dice I've been working on. That's a 20-sided dice. But uh, here's one that was somebody else's design. Let's see if I can get some light through it. But it's an acrylic D&D dice. Um, they're not going to just be clear. I'm going to have... Some mixed colors and custom colors and you'll be able to buy those but I'm finding that the resin printer resin reacts to silicone in a bad way so a lot of people coat them so what I'm doing right now for an example it's my 3d printer here gets louder when you open the door I am 3d printing some uh, dice. Now the problem with the FDM printer is it prints in layers, like little you know, like a pencil, and it leaves lines. So I'm gonna have a video about that, what I'm doing. But anyways, welcome back, or welcome me back. I'm coming back, and I'm gonna start making videos again and posting them here. Also, I got a TikTok. Um, I'll have that link down below. But for the most part, I'm just, I'm trying to be the best me. Took, I didn't take a break. It wasn't a purposefully break. I would just sit down and just not feel any passion. And it's not just 3D design. It was video gaming. It was watching TV. All I wanted to do was eat and sleep. Now, I'm trying to get back into it. So, we will... Get back to it. Catch you in the next video.
Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening.